How was your trip? It was really good, you know. Right now, I'm just tired. Mm. But you know, most important, I miss you, that's all. I miss you too. Like, I can't believe you are right by my side. I mean, this is like a dream come true. I'm still here. Why are you guys come not revving do it! Come on, man. Come on, bro. Come on, man. Uh, you are looking fresh and stuff with all the cologne smelling on you. Bro. I know all the girls they be chasing after you. Where you got it from, self? Nah, I got it from the money store. Bro, you know, this is this is life in this country, bro. Gotta look good, man. I know. You yeah. girls are still chasing you like before? He said, I say he has gotten worse. <laughs> he has not changed. <laughs> Nah, bro, but honestly, I'm really, really glad you're here. At least I got somebody to chill with now, bro. I know, bro. Don't worry, my man. We're chill. We're run from the dive here, bro. Uh, uh, uh. Don't worry. We're run things here, you know. But I'll be worried. <laughs> no, <laughs> she know I got her to the fullest. My man, you you sounding more American these days with your arts and everything, I changed. Bro, I was about to say the same thing. You like just from like, bro, man, you sounding more American than me, <laughs> okay. bro. Yeah, my, my man, you know, you know, like, bro, like, we, my woman, she and I, we talk on the phone every other time. Yeah. And, you know, I'm talking to you too, so the American arts can just become his You better run, you better run Cause she's coming for you Okay, breakfast is all set mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is really nice. I like it. Oh, thanks. <laughs> what is it? A ginger or something? Yeah, it's ginger tea. It's good for the stomach. Oh. Mm. It is really good. It is delicious. Yeah. Take it back. Mm. Mm. This peanut butter tastes good. Mm. <laughs> Honey. I must say this. I used to make it to the extent I couldn't sleep in my own bed. <laughs> I know, man. Um, I also like, <clears throat> you know, used to take your pictures and put it on bed and be dreaming about you all the time, you know? Oh, wow. I didn't know that. So, how's my mother in law? Um, She's doing good. I mean, you know, mom. <clears throat> they always love their kids. They don't they don't want them to go out like that. You know. So when I was coming, she was like, Are you leaving me to go America again? Like, you know, so I <laughs> mm. She always does that. Even when I was back in Liberia. She never wanted you to leave her side. <laughs> I'm not talking about you coming over here to America. Mm. No, that's, that's, that's something very crazy. She's like. going to suffer a heart attack. Mm. <laughs> I mean, that's that's motherly love. You know? Our parents, they're always giving her that love. is unconditional. So. Mommy loved this son. It's no longer beside her. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how she's going to manage. Like. <laughs> well. Oh, my God. She loves it so much. Like, oh, mm -mm. Mm. Hey. Yo, what's up? Joel, how you doing, buddy? Man, nothing much. I'm just preparing for work, bro. Work? That's fine. At least, you know, you're going to work and stuff. That's pretty good. And later on, what would be done? Oh, I see. Man, I'll call you after work. Yeah, you see me after work. Once I get out, I'll just call you. But anyway, how is madame? Well, I'm just sitting here with my wife, my beautiful wife, and... Guess what? She just made a breakfast and that's what we're eating. I got you, bro, man. Be safe, man. Take care. I'll call you. <sighs> what does he want again? Baby, you know, Carlos is a very good guy. And 
you know, he said he wants us to go out later on today. I mean, that's the offer that I can't just let go, you know? Well, go ahead. Go enjoy yourself. As for me, I'm getting ready for work. Baby, listen. Joel is good. All right? So and he been my friend for a very long time. So it's just for us to go out and, you know, just do a boy's thing. That's it. You know? Remember, this is America. You just literally came in this country. You have to choose your friends wisely. I know. I'm going to be very hmm. careful. All right. Hey, I got to get to work. You know, I'm running out of time. So. I know, because the time. Yeah, works. like, you know, let me get this thing in the kitchen. Yeah. Yeah, let me, you know, let me get this. Hold on a second. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Thank yeah. You. And I told you I'll bring you more fire to the street, baby. Their roof is on fire. Fire. Their roof is yeah. on fire. Turn it up. Let's go. I'm going to feel your hair. Then the room has got out of here. Eh? I'm going to buy your skin there. Then the room has got out of your skin there. Eh? I'm going to buy you. This is pretty good. Oh, yeah. That's the wrap. That's the thing. I'm going to buy you liquor. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look. I never know that guy will be so gentle. After all, we got cut right in the heart. I mean, right in it. His friend was so speechless, he could not say a word. He just really can't believe it. Could you imagine that? Wow! Woo! Trust me, girlfriend. Y'all lucky. Tell me about it. Why he take you to his house in the first place? Knowing for the way his friends always come in there. People have taken you to a hotel or somewhere else. Right. Even at your place. Right. Girl, trust me, that's why I love food service. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? I <laughs> see oh, Now, why you can deal with all the beautiful girls? <laughs> Man, it's normal. But for me, I don't come here all the time, bro. But I mean, this place is cool. A lot of people come here to relieve their stress, bro. People who got a lot of stuff on their mind and use this place to put their broken pieces back together. I mean, it's a cool place, a good place for you to relax yourself. You know, just chill. Man, you meet a lot of good people here. I meet people of good, high self esteem, bro. Look at me, Aries. I don't know who to call. Let me go grab some. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. I got you. Listen, bro. You know, say I'm married. So we got to go home, bro. I'm going marry, marry. Leave the marry stuff. Get rid of your face now. I'm married, bro. Or like, leave this marry stuff. All right, bro? Chill with me. I'm not chilling with you. There was something in life, bro. Call. You can't drink anything at <laughs> all, man. That's the latest song, bro. Shit. Yes, man. Can I have her eyes? Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't run out of eyes. Okay. You taking something? I'm good. Thank you. She not shake it. No space on my table. Too much drinks on my table. All the get on my table. Get you flip on my table. You guess. I saw a corner my Bluetooth. You guess. Then it's not coming to two. You guess. Put support in my hotspot. You guess. Then she spray that waffle. You guess. Then I take out my drop top. You guess. Then she say, Oh, God. Oh, my God, Gavin. Look at that guy on the right side. He's so cute. Look. Both of them look handsome. Can we just make friends with them? You know why? I am not going to keep hurting my eyes from this thing. I'm Go going to so trust Go me. Girl. Go girl. Go girl. Go girl. I like it. Pretty boy, not checking. I'm working, you're working. She bleaching, you're not bleaching. I'm not getting drunk already over there. I'm not getting drunk already over there. I'm not getting drunk Hello. I uh, hope I'm not interrupting you guys. Nah. My friend and I was sitting at the back monitoring you guys' conversation, so I decided to come and say hi. By the way, I'm Alicia. Oh, I'm Joel. Yeah, yeah. call me Carlos. Oh, Carlos. Yeah. Yeah. Um, can we sit in the back with you? Is that okay with you guys? Oh, yeah, sure. Oh, oh. we don't mind. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Come on. Oh, 
Hey guys, this is my friend Larry. Oh, Larry. I'm Joel. Larry. Nice to meet you. Oh, you got us. Larry. I see why you guys refuse my offer. I told you we got a lot on the table. So, but trust me, next time, I would love to spoil your pocket. <laughs> So where you gotta live? <laughs> I don't know, like, bro. Because you really love Neil in his community, though. Yeah, I just came from that, bro. Oh my god, I see. By the way, welcome to Philly. That's how we roll. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I've been here right about Philly. That's your wine, love, bro. Oh, okay. I love to chill with you, man. This just me. Thank you. Mm -hmm. But by the way, Carlos, can I have your number? Um, so I'm actually married and, and you know I can't really give my number out other people. Like what are you talking about, Carlos? You don't have a ring on your finger, so because I'm a, I I leave my ring in the car though. Come on, you now okay? Be nice to a lady, okay? So I need that number. Don't worry, I'll give you his number. Oh, thank, thank you. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Right here, call him anytime. Oh, right. sure. I'm definitely going to give you a call, Carlos. No the problem. love hanging out with me. Right, That's no why problem. B Grace is looking. No problem. So, y'all don't think you know me? Oh, don't worry. I got a bill. That B Grace is sitting with Carlos. Oh, we got to leave. Oh, poor oh, guys. I'm so sorry. We're supposed to be three years on there with our girlfriend, Lena. Well, she didn't show us, so we can't just sit and we have to check on her. So I'm going to call you and we're going to hang out anytime. So, okay? Yes. Oh. That's a girl, right? Yes. Uh, I have come out here for you. Keep the cheese, don't worry. Oh, thank you. Alright. Have a good night. Thank you. Bye. 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 Why did you give my number to the girl? Bro, that was a stunning shit, my man. Eat your girl, so a new sock check, brother. Shit, not a stunning shit. You know what I'm saying? Why you give my. Bro, calm down, my man. This is a miracle. Philadelphia, to be precise, bro. There are a lot of girls here, my man. Bro, you rolling with me. Be cool. What are you for? You put him in something where I'll not be able to handle you know? Bro, I got it, right? But where will you tell me again and see you pay for it? Where is your money from? Why are you from here? So. Baby. Yes, yeah. You know you roll beautiful, right? <laughs> and every time that I set my eyes on you, all that I see is love, happiness. I mean, just <laughs> name the rest of it. Oh God, thank you, honey. That's why I give you my heart, mm. and I promise to be with you for the rest of my life. Are you sure about that? <laughs> and I promise. Yeah. I, I also promise to love you, cherish you, and. I mean, make you feel happy, you know? Oh, that's so sweet of you. Yeah. <clears throat> um, I like the pond. Yeah. And I think there was something amazing about this place. Guess what that is? What is that? Come and sit, I'll tell you. <laughs> you see this park, right? Mm hmm Um, actually it looks that where the love birds, they usually come, you know? Yeah. To play love and all of that. It is beautiful here. And there was something. Mm -hmm. Um, probably some days, right? We're gonna come out here with our kids, and they can just play all around. Oh here. yes, <laughs> they're gonna love it out here. <laughs> come on, let's get going. Those guys have everything a woman needs, most especially the one who gave me his number cards. Girl, he's so handsome. I think I'm falling for him already. <laughs> well, 
the one that got to my feelings is his smile. Hmm. When that guy Kala smile at you, <laughs> I could feel him right in my arm, like feel like kissing him. You can't be serious, girl. Yeah? That my man, you pressing in your arms like that? Your man. Go, go and look for your own man. In fact, this guy we're talking about, he's married. I even saw him right and on so his what? finger. <laughs> so, what? Who cares? Who cares, girl? Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> Wow, the both of you guys haven't even gone on a date yet, and you are already claiming him, even with his marital status. Damn, you guys are really funny. Look, no, girlfriend, <laughs> let me say this to you mm -hmm. I have gone beyond a date. Really? In fact, as we speak, I have him in my palm. <laughs> <laughs> are you serious? Oh, yes, girlfriend, I am telling you. Watch me do my thing. Whatever. And you're going to watch the game. At least I can watch you one. That place is going to be Okay. Okay, well, that's the best thing. Check it. I'm seeing right now Carlos but I'm seeing with some lady she must probably be his wife what are you talking about Lena look I am going right there to get his number he's so cute How you doing? I'm good. I mean, what are you doing here, though? Well, I'm on my way at the food market, and when I saw you, I thought I could just stop by and say hi. I mean, that's really tough for the viewer. I just from the mall, and just want to get one or two, you know, for the house. And I'm about to head out. Carlos, right? From the club the other day? Yeah, and that was you. Where's your friend? Oh, she's home. Oh, hope she's doing great. She's good. That's fine. Um, can I have your number, please? Oh, yeah, sure. Um, don't tell me you really lost my number. No, you didn't get rid of me. Oh, that's fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and zero. You Seven. said eight, nine, zero? Zero, yeah. I mean, just give me a call, okay? I'll call you. All right, take care. Have a good time. Um, baby, listen, I'm, I'm really sorry for you. What was the meaning of that? How could you give your number to a street girl right in front of me? That that was being so much disrespectful to me. Babe, listen, I, I understand how you feel. But that was somebody just passing by and probably they just need a job. A job? I don't I, I don't know. Like, I'm just being jealous because I don't trust those Philadelphia chicks. Yeah. They are not trustworthy. That's my concern. I'm sorry. Nobody gonna take you. I am, I am really tired of this. Here 
Hi, Joel. Hi. How you doing? I'm good. It's been a long time since we met. I know. How your friend Fanon's doing? He is good. I spoke with him a few minutes ago. Oh, okay. Can you please do me a favor? Favor, favor, favor. What could that be? Come on, Joel. All I need you is to set up a date with me and myself to meet. And I know you can do it because he is your friend. I'm not in the best position to schedule a date between you two. Carlos is a goodness man. Talk to him if he agree, fine. I know you're not in the best position to do that, but all I need you to do is to deliver my message to him. That's it. I know you can make that possible. Okay. Okay. I'll try. She must be talking about Carlos. She never get her eyes off him. Was she sleep with every good looking guy in Fiddy? Wow. I got a surprise for her. I'm not going to let this lie. Let's play the game. Thank you, Hemson. Can I come to my job now? Go ahead. Girl, you really need to chill. That's the same way Alicia is heavily kneading on Nico's neck. She can't give Carl a chance to have a good time with his wife. <laughs> What's funny? You sounding like a little girl. Let me tell you something. Carlos is cute. I am falling in love with Carlos. And nobody should stay in my way. I mean nobody. <laughs> wow. So that's how desperate you guys have turned? Really into breaking other people's home? Girl, let me tell you. <laughs> we will see who will have the best man in Philly. Just watch the game. <laughs> Don't just tell on me. Don't tell nobody. Girl, I was just kidding. Have fun, my darling. Just be careful. All right. Okay, talk to you later. All right, my love. Take care now. Bye-bye. Bye. Those girls. You better run, you better run Cause she's coming for you Come on, man. Why are you calling this out of one? 
I'm so sorry, I know it's too early to call you. But the truth is, I can't get it off of my hands. I'm just looking up from bad as to another. For real, I love you. I understand why we are. I'll call you back, okay? I'll, I'll talk to you. Hello? Hello? Yeah. So you know why you're sitting with him so long too? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna stop bothering me though. I'm not. Carlos, you're so special to me. Am I? Yes. One thing that ever happened in my life that messes with me. My feelings for you is so deep. I really do love you. Wow. I mean, you, you're beautiful, and any man want to have you as their wife. You know what I mean? Like, not just me. I mean, I can't. And secondly, I've been married for five years, so it's not possible. Truthfully, Carlos, I really do love you. All I'm asking for, just give me that chance. My heart will never fall rest until you give me a chance to show you how much I really do love you, Carlos. Hmm. You know what? I know how you feel. But I'm gonna think about it. Is that okay? Okay. Come on, boy. You can be free anytime you're around me. I got the deal. Sure, that. Okay, continue with me. I can taste it. Mm. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Just a little bit of spice. And, you know, I don't feel it like. Just like a rubber. So when am I going to see you again? Come on, baby. Like you already have my number. So anytime you want to see me, just give me a call. Okay. You know where to find me. <sighs> you need more? Oh, I'm tired. Why are you so tired, though? Good. That was good. <sighs> I'm good, and you? I'm great. Are you? Are you? 
No, I'm not home, but I'm at my mom's place. I will give you a call when I get back. Okay, please. All right, yeah. What's that? Nah, I mean. Oh, man. Mm hmm. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. to an automatic voice message system. What's wrong, honey? You got me worried. And I call your phone, it was switched off. Come on, baby. Why are you stressed up? I mean, I was stuck up in the traffic, and when you called, like, I couldn't pick up my phone. That's what happened. I know, but at least you should have got in contact with me. You know what? See how beautiful you look. I'm real sorry. You know, you have to stop this. I'm high enough with this. I understand. You know what? Come on, baby. Like, you know. I have to be stressing yourself up. Why would I not be stressed out? So why am I do this to you? I understand. Like, like, I'm so sorry. All right, baby. Let's go then. Okay. <laughs> I did send you a text. And what time you say again? Um, uh, five o'clock because of traffic. Okay. You know, Carlos is like a southern boy. I think he is the camera a beautiful girl. Well, as for me, really living in a terrible and a terrible situation is part of life. But smiling in a situation is an out of life. I love a guy that is gentle and fair. Well, y'all know my choice. I don't like to talk more about it. But any guy that belongs in the class of gentleness is my kind. There are some guys who make you feel the love for you so gloomy and wiggling. Do you really know that? Yes. As for me, I think Kala is a nice guy. He's so romantic and good in bed. Leaving him going to be the worst thing I will ever have in my life. <laughs> uh, I know, girl. Ah, but I think you need to slow down. You're taking this too far. I used to know his wife, Nicole. That girl used to live right by my house back in the days on Clover Lane. She's too damn quiet. Hmm? Do you know his wife? I do, my dear. I know Nicole. Ah. Look, girlfriend, I don't know why you always love bringing Drada's story out. She is not your sister. Why worry about her? Please. Stop yo, 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 stop oh my gosh, she's true. Like, yes. It's not that serious. It is serious. We come to Carlos. <laughs> <Whatever. laughs> <laughs> I swear. Really? <laughs> yes, when it comes to Carlos, girl. You don't play with that. That's my pepper bush. Can we just get home? I have a okay. hard place to go. All right. <laughs> okay. Wow. <laughs> Nobody mess with your car. Oh,
Hello? Can I help you? Hey, I'm looking for one Mr. Carlos Williams. I don't know if I'm at the right place. Of course you are. Is there any problem? Oh no, not at all. I'm his office secretary and I brought documents to him in the office keys because I'm going for vacation this evening. Okay, I'm sorry. Come in. I'm sorry, but I was missing you and I have no other choice. Stop what you're doing, Mary. Thank you. What are you doing? My wife is here. Come on, stop. Why are you behaving so mean to me? Mary, listen, I told you I was going to give you a phone call. Why can't you just go home? You don't need to give me a phone call. Mary, listen to me. I said you should get out of this house. Get out! Wait. Are you serious right now? Do you know what you're about to put yourself into? I mean, I said, my wife is here. Can you just keep quiet and get out? So Stop! Why are you doing this to me? Mary, listen, if you don't get out, you're never gonna have access to this school. Can you just go? Okay, 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 I will do it. But, Stop. you gotta give me your case. That's what you want, it will happen right now. No, I am not. Get out. Um, are you sure you're going to call me? Yeah, I'm going to call you. Are you sure? Yeah. Come on. Get out. Let me go. What kind of problem is this? You want to bring problems in my relationship. But before you do that, I'm going to get rid of you. Nonsense. Honey? Yes, baby. Uh, um, did the girl give you the, the documents and the keys? Nah, she said she was going to do that later on. Uh, okay. Um, I got some dry rice, plain tea, and oatmeal for you. Okay. okay. Imagine the stress out there. I mean, can you imagine? Yesterday, Maria came at my house. Why my wife was home? What? I'm fucking serious, bro. Did she suspect anything? Not at all, bro. The fool was able to convince Nicole, telling her that she's my secretary at my office. Can you imagine that? Oh, wow. <laughs> Man, at least your wife did not suspect anything. That's the most important thing for now, bro. Man, you gotta be careful. Mary, she's very, very crazy. She is capable of putting you into trouble, bro. I try to understand, bro. But I'm not gonna allow any stupid girl to just walk at my house at any time. I mean, I'm not gonna accept that, bro. Some dumbass girl just walk on me at any time. No, I'm not here for that. But it's okay, man. We will take care of that, bro. I know. You always wanna act like a player. But for me, I have to protect my zone. I know, bro. Man, chill, you know what, bro? It's the weekend, man. Let's get out, bro. Let's go for a chilly spot, man. Let's chill, bro. Yeah, it's the weekend. Okay. All right? Scary enough for you. Why 
why did you come to my house yesterday without even calling me? I mean, why if my wife would have suspected you, what would have happened? Come down, pretty boy. She's not going to suspect anything. I know what I was doing. And if even if she happened to suspect anything, I'm going to take care of you like a king. Why worry? Mary, just listen to yourself. Mary, are you listening to yourself? Do you think I'm going to ruin my marriage all because of you? I'm not going to do that. I'm not stupid, okay? <laughs> really? Is she better off than me? Look, I, I have all it takes for you to keep me, okay? I am beautiful, well paid, have a very nice car, decent home, you name it. So what are you talking about? Mary, like I told you, there's nothing about you that's going to make me to ruin my marriage. All right? And never and ever that you walk to my house would I even give me a phone call. All right? Look, you have to calm down. I know you've been stressed out from your job. You need a massage right now. So just calm down. All right. I said stop. That's what I told you. What? I can take care of you. Don't you doubt me? You, you, you need a massage. Relax. I just want you to lay down. Everywhere that she goes, she gonna set you on fire. Everywhere that she goes, everywhere that she, she goes, gonna set you right on fire. The way she moves, the way she walks, she gonna play you all she mean it. The way she moves, the way she talks, she gonna play you all she mean it. Where are you coming from? That's all the night. It's about 3 a.m. in the morning. Joel invited me for dinner. And you know, he's my childhood friend, so I couldn't let him down. What are beautiful lies? You never seem to convince me with lies like this. And you know what, Joel? You are at the office. What other bullshit is about? You can never come one day and take me for dinner. But well, you and Joel are always going out for dinner. You know what? I am getting sick and fed of your too much of lies. Honey, listen. What's going on with you? Why are you being so suspicious of me? Why, why would I trust you? Tell me. Why would I trust you, Carlos? Don't you know I'm a woman? And blood runs through my vein? All the men treat their wives with care. But some of you African men, you all treat us like something but a piece of shit. After all I am doing for you, I'm working two jobs. Just to sustain our bills. Honey, stop this. Alright? I'm sorry. And I promise you, this won't happen again. Is this what you promised me? I thought we were supposed to live together for the rest of our lives in happiness. Honey, you know I truly love you. And I'm not going to do anything stupid because I don't want an enemy to laugh at us. I'm having the feelings that you are playing game, games with me. Why would you think of me like that? I'm not playing games with you. Come on, let's go to bed. It's, 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 it's late. All right, come on, sweetie. See how beautiful you look. I just out of the night you look so beautiful. I'm sorry.
What's going on, bro? Sorry, Greg. How you doing? Man, I'm good, man. What's up? What's up, man? You're looking so unhappy. What's going on, bro? Man, I'm in a serious problem, man. Like, wow, my wife, bro. Wait, hold on. Let me get your glass, bro. Yeah. Okay. Let me tell you. I mean, that's just you drinking all this. Yeah, man. It's a cool day, bro. Nowhere to go. I just relaxing, man. You know what's going on, bro? Man, I cannot I never see you being unhappy like this. What's going on? Bro, like I told you, man. I'm in a very serious problem with my wife. And, you know, I don't really know where she's getting her feelings from. I think somebody's giving her information about me or something. <laughs> hey, buddy, you already know, man. There is no problem I don't have a solution for. Lay on me. What's it? My wife, she's actually thinking that I'm having an affair with somebody. She's actually suspecting me about that. What do you mean by that, Carlos? Women will always suspect. Once she ain't catch you, you don't have no girl out there. Bro, just give her what suspicious. <laughs> Joel, listen. Let me tell you something, right? Last night, I was actually with Marie. And she kept me the whole night that I went home late. And my wife was mad about it. So why would he even let her to control you in the first place? Man, just position her. I'm actually afraid of what's going to happen if she gets to know. She's observing my whole mood, bro. You're the man. You should be able to control your wife. You should be able to calm her down, bro. But right now, man, I'm so disturbed. You know, and... I don't really want my mom to hear about this because if she gets to know what's going to happen next, I don't know what's going to happen to her. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm also afraid about that. But you know what? Instead of us just sitting here and drinking, let's go and have lunch, bro. Let's find something to eat. Right. That sounds good, bro. We yeah. can talk on that better, man. Yeah. Yeah. yeah now that makes sense. I yeah. got you, bro. You take this key. All right. Yeah. Okay, yeah. man. Grab the key or I'll ride with you. Now you go around. Oh, okay, 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 I got you, bro. I wanted to ask you for a favor. What, baby? You know I can do anything for you. Just tell yeah. me. We need to talk to your friend Alisa, man, for to slow down Carlos. You know, Carlos coming home late is really affecting his marriage. And it will be of no good for a woman to break another woman's marriage. You know that, right? Well, I know, right? I will talk to her to slow down. Like, I mean, Carlos is another woman, husband. So, I will feel the same way if my husband coming home late. I will try to talk to her this morning. Thank you. Thank you so much, Carlos. You stay one more? Yeah, come on, come on, babe. Oh.
Nicole. Woo. So fun. Wow. It's been a long time. I haven't seen you around here. Where have you been? Oh well, I've been around. It's just that where I used to live mm -hmm. was too small, so I moved to Ceylon Avenue to a bigger apartment since my husband came. Wow, I see. So that's why we haven't been seeing you around here at most of the parties and cookout? Secondly, I'm working two jobs. My husband is here. Mm -hmm. We are trying to make family. So all that party and cookout is not really necessary for now. <laughs> that's true. I mean, at least you have someone you can call husband. Not like some of us around here who are still looking for our soulmates and king. Mm. Just keep praying. Because most of those guys in Philadelphia, they are not serious. They are only trying to benefit from you. Trust me. I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> that's true, my dear. I have my own share. And you know, that's one thing I admire about you. You always speak the truth no matter how it hurts. <sighs> my darling. There's something I really want to tell you. And if I don't tell you this, God will judge me one day. What, well, Lena? Tell me. Is there anything I can help you with? Hmm. Nicole, mm -hmm. it's about your husband, Carlos. What about him? Carlos is having an affair with two Whoa. of my best Whoa. friends. Are you sure of what you're telling me? I put my life. Why would I lie to you? And those two girls I'm talking about, they are desperate. They can do anything in this Philadelphia to have a man. All in the name of having the best man. Huh. Hmm. I've been having the feelings about him. My husband is not acting funny. He always comes home late. Mm -hmm. And he started to lie to me. Each time he comes home, he got a different story to tell me. Hmm. My dear, that's how they can behave. They will use your man and then dump him. If you are not careful, you fall victim. So you really have to be careful and stay on your ground. Hmm. Thank you so much, Lena, for telling me. I'm going to gather my evidence and send it to his mom in Liberia. My dear, if that's what's best for you, that's what you need to do, my dear. Well, I keep looking at the time. It's time for me to go get my kids from school. They'll be off in five minutes. Thank you so much. I knew something wasn't quite right. My Easter would not lie to me. I knew something wasn't quite right. Everywhere she goes, she gon' set you on fire. Everywhere that she goes, everywhere that she, she goes, gon' set you right on fire. The way she moan, the way she walk, she gon' play you all she mean it. The way she moan, the way she talk, she gon' play you all she mean it. Your house outside waiting for you, my car. What the hell? What are you doing at my house? You better run, better run. you come here to check up on me but i don't want you coming at my house why if my wife sees you so what become of me what become of me you don't know i need you i miss you so much babe what's going on you know what how many times do you want me to tell you that i'm going to call you how many times do i tell that's you that's why you keep saying and you're not calling me you're not picking up my phone you know what get out you look so sweet babe. i said you should get out you look so sweet love you no mm. Love you, you look so sweet, darling. <sighs> Where you coming from? 
Um, so it's one of our neighbor's son who actually um, scraped the car, so his dad and I would have an argument. Why would he do that? Honey, don't argue with them. Some of those kids got guns and they can kill people for no reason. I actually understand. I mean, you don't have to worry about that. I'll be fine. Hmm. You never know. I know. I understand. I'm going to stay safe, okay? Wow. It's been a minute. I know. You guys look so beautiful. And you're looking so cute, girlfriend. Thank you. <laughs> anyway, what can I offer you? Do you have a real one? Of course I do. Yep, that would do. Oh, right, I'm coming. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. I know. It's going to be a long time with that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this tastes good. Thank you. Where have you all been since last summer? We've been hanging around. Since me and my fiance started living together, I don't really go out like before. Because he is so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> no, guys. <laughs> Great. So talk about fiance again, please. Oh, oh. I haven't seen Linda for a very long time. She gonna give you the G's. I'm out. <laughs> Just me. She gonna give you that. Wow. Linda is pregnant for some dude who's in the US Mary. <laughs> That's nice. At least she has someone she can hope on. <laughs> because now in this to find a good relationship is not easy. I don't know, but I think Carlos wife is suspecting in having an affair. Wait a Carlos, Nicole Hosman, the couple that lives next door? Yep. <laughs> Why would she suspect him when he have all the time with you? You need to get that guy with space. Love girlfriend. I suggest that you should slow down a little bit before his wife catch the ball for you guys. I see why you told his wife to come and visit me because Carlos and I live on the same block. That is not possible. Carlos has been become part of me. There is no way I'm going to give him space. I do love him. More than his wife? <laughs> give that guy a space and let his wife breathe. Come on, Catherine. Carlos is the sweetest guy I have ever met. He's so generous in everything. And I think a good woman like me needs to hold him tight. Look, don't mind her generosity and play him for a fool. You need to slow down. You keep pressing I have to say he's your husband. <laughs> Shut up, Mary. I'm going to do anything to have him. Okay? Nothing can stop me from having Carlos. Wow. wow. Calm down, girl. You're taking this thing too personal. For Carlos' business, your temperature is too hot. Why are you so into him? I expect you to enjoy and live. Not to hold him down. You know I have fun with a lot of guys and let them leave my home the next day. But for Carlos, it's different. Except every time we meet, his feelings keep going deeper and the love keeps getting stronger. I'm it's over different. you. I'm over you. 
I need music right now. You Why would not that is begging me? It's like you never have any sex mm -hmm. before. I'm no. over you right I'm now. I'm telling you. <laughs> you want to get hurt. Wow. Me got hurt. Girl, girl, girl. Girl. Yes. I wish I get what she want, girl. Baby, I'm going to be traveling next week to Australia to meet my international business partner. And that mm. is on behalf of my company. Okay. You know, our merchandise has been stuck at the seaport and I have to go and do everything possible to get it out. You know. <laughs> oh yeah. You are a very smart gentleman. And I know what you're capable of doing when it comes to talking. And you are very eloquent when it comes to pushing your points through. But if I may ask, who is that luckiest chick that is going with you on the trip? Come on, sweetie. Like, I'm just going on behalf of the company. You know, like my allowance that the company has given me is not gonna it's not gonna permit me to take somebody with me. You know what? I'm gonna see next week what to do. Me. Mm. Come on, Carlos. Don't worry about any expenditure. You know I'm available whenever you need me. All I need from you is your attention. I got you, boy. Rolly? Mm-hmm. I got you, too, baby. Like I told you, like, hopefully next week, I'm going to let you know. the reason why you keep telling me slow down for you to have it to yourself <laughs> oh hey, right there are you killing me right now what are you talking about bitch he's not your husband the last time that i checked Carlos has his wife at home so why are you yelling on top of your lungs like he's your husband Marie, listen, listen. Girl, you need to chill because the both of us just a sad chick. Marie, you need to chill, Marie. You have to chill. What are you doing? <laughs> Talking about sad chick. You yes. son of the bitch. And I'm going to make it. Get the fuck you. off I'm me. I'm going to. Get your fuck off, girl. There's quite much good shit. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. 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 Fuck 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 you.
I know, honey. Well, every time you come home, we don't get to spend time together like before. It's like someone is taking you away from me. Hey, I'm so tired. Man. This has never happened to me. For my husband to push me away, something must be the cause. Or he's having an affair with somebody else. Beautiful girl like me. Why up to now? I cannot find a me to marry me. Why go? My age is no longer on the calendar. Some of my friends are married. And the sad thing is, the guy I truly love is also married. Something must be the problem. Let me try his friend Joel. Since he's not yet married. Hi, Joel. How are you doing? Hey, what's up? I'm okay. How was right to live? I'm good. Yeah, I just got off work. I'm kind of a little tired. I know. You just got to do what you need to do. Oh, can you please help me to hang on my TV on the wall? TV? Please. Oh, okay. Yeah, just, just text me your address. I'll come over. Okay. All right. Thank you. I appreciate it. She goes, she goes <sighs> you on fire. Everywhere that she goes, everywhere that she, she goes, gonna set you right on fire. The way she moan, the way she walks, she gonna play you all she mean it. The way she moan, the way she talks, she gonna play you all she mean it. La 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 la. How are you doing, Alisa? I'm good. I was white today. It's okay. You're already in America. You're stressing people up. I know. Yeah. You look good. Thank you. <laughs> it's a nice place to have it too. Thank you. <sighs> you shut up my mouth, man. What a TV you want me to replace? Oh, I already fixed the problem. I will need you to pull this off for me. Uh, okay, so let me grab the tools from my car real quick. You know, I can do it. Oh, good morning. I have a seat. I've already fixed the problem. You don't have to go for anything. But what if I tell you that my fears for you is real? Will you believe me? Come on, Alicia. I don't think so. Look. You gave him a childhood friend. Carlos, you're going out. Like, how is it possible? I don't want to get into trouble now. Why you keep talking about Carlos? He's married. Just let him be. I decide who to share my feelings with. Everywhere that she goes, 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 everyw
she goes and she don't say she Wow. Trying to set me up? No, come on, Joel. What are you doing? Yeah. Oh, man. Hey. So baby, I ain't got no time for your games. Oh, man. You don't see what I bought shit for? Let me tell you, I got you on camera. We'll meet at the house. Come on, man. Baby, listen. Hey. Baby, calm down. She will be just fine. If you like, you can come home with me tonight. What the fuck are you talking about? I'm talking about my wife right here. You tell me bullshit. Are you out of the fucking man? What? Are you serious? You know what? Come on, get the fuck out of my face. Baby! You're leaving me over here? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I can't believe this. Okay, let me call Uber. Yo, what's up, Carlos? How you doing, brother? You good? Man, I'm doing great, bro. Like, shit. I just... I'm I'm in a mess right now, brother. What? Bro, you don't believe, man. My wife, she just caught me with Marie at the supermarket, bro. When we were coming out. Damn, bro. Man, how, how could you go to the grocery store without getting your press list, bro? Bro, worst of all, she actually was recording every freaking thing that happened, bro. She recorded everything? Man, you should have known better. Man, the girls that all get involved to speak on man, bro. Like, I don't really know what I'm going to do, bro. Like, I'm going home, shit. I don't know what I'm going to tell her, bro. Okay, okay. So, so, so what do you want me to do now? Well, you're a player, man. Tell me. What do you think? <laughs> bro. The only thing you can do right now is just go home and talk to your wife, bro. Make up something like tell her she's a family friend or you know her from Liberia. Something, just make up something, bro. Man, hopefully she she actually listens to what I have to tell her, bro. Man, I'm 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 really fucked up, bro. I'm telling you, man. Shit. Yeah, bro. That, that that's the only thing you can say for bro. That, that's the only thing you can do. Yeah. Okay, man. I'll talk to you later. All right, bro. I have to go home now.
Hey, babe. Babe. Where are you going? I'm so sorry. It's not what you think. Mari is not my girlfriend. I mean, I was driving, coming in and had a flat tire, and she and I went to the supermarket to get stuff for the office. I'm so sorry, honey. You are such a pathological liar. Who do you think I am? Do you think I'm stupid? I knew exactly what was happening. But I didn't talk about it at the time because I didn't have enough evidence to prove it. But you see this man up here? Baby, yeah, listen, I actually understand how you feel. I'm really sorry. And I promise, like, I'm, 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 I'm not doing nothing. I've been calling you since today. No response. Only to will see my husband at the supermarket. Hawking and kissing the same girl you claim to be an office secretary. You'll pay for this, Carlos. Please, I'm, I'm, I can better explain myself to you. It's the work of the girl. Please, baby. I'm sorry. You are so deceitful, Carlos. I give you my heart. Like I did everything for you as a wife. You know what? I don't ever want to see you again. Go ahead, live your life. Have them all. But I think you want it today. Those girls you see, they got absolutely nothing to offer you. Baby, please, please forgive me. Like, like I'm not willing to lose you right now. I'm, I'm really sorry. Please, baby, please, please. You don't have to go. I'm sorry, but please. Baby. Baby, please. Here she goes. She gonna set you on fire. Everywhere that she go, everywhere that she, she go, gonna set you right on fire. The way she moan, the way she walk, she gonna play you all she mean it. The way she moan, the way she talk, she gonna play you all she mean it. La 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 la, whoa oh, la 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 la, la 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 la. You better run, you better run Cause she's coming for you 